Hello there and welcome back. We are Lord Marek of Macy's Hook and we have an heir who is 11. Hopefully he'll uh, come of age before we die and we won't have to go for a regency but maybe uh, maybe we'll have to stick with a regency for a few years. We did also have a son but he's gone off to become a maester because we didn't like him. He's not a very good, good future, future lord was he? Oh, the realm's not really up to much. Ah, we're going to become friends with him now, are we? Very good. Well done, Pate. Too bad you have a rubbish name and I didn't get to name you, but... Whatever. Whatever indeed. We will one day. Lord Paramount Tywin. Ah. Lord Paramount Tywin is now a traitor. Well, what is he doing? He's attacking them over Branstone. Where's Branstone? Where is Branstone? There, he wants Branstone, okay. It is very rubbish and not worth it, but whatever. A sound investment. A group of craftsmen come to your court show off their work. Depends if you find goods. We'll uh we'll do the investment, sure. This might be of worth to us. It might bring us profit. Ah, let's hope so. What on uh, Monford? Amassing troops. For the invasion of your brother, if it ever were to happen. At this rate, it doesn't really seem like it. New Lord Commander on the wall. Ah, Denny's Malister. Very good. Very good. It's good. Loads of fellas in his court. Benjin Stark included, so Benjin didn't become the. Uh... There's also a Tyrell up there, Lufa Tyrell. Ah. No, oh, good for him. I guess. Now, where's my investment? I want my money back. Plus interest. And I want to invest it. Because that's what we do here. We make castles better. All entertain. This is the Kingswood. This is below me. I'll have to go over to you so you can imprison me. I shall arrange this reward. No, I won't. So I'll owe people a favour. We don't do rewards of gold? No! Also, why have we got a peasant revolt all the way over there? Do we have land beyond the wall? Why do we have land beyond the wall? How's Bolwa? Has taken over a load of stuff beyond the wall. It's probably due to inheritance, but I don't get why it would happen. I've where they are defeated. Well, Tywin Lannister has been named enemy of the realm, but there is no civil war going on. Would be nice if there was. Now he's getting his claims come through. Where the hell are mine? Seriously. Yes, Tyrion. Pays Macy, what do we want from you? Well, you seem like a diplomatic man and an economic man, but we want to go for economic. Yes, Pate. Yes, you better become a better man. Hates Macy. Ah, oh, here we go. Strong claim on the Lordship of Bywater. Very good. We'll take it. Ultimately, does put us into a bit of debt. So what we'll be doing is taking a loan, unfortunately. Hopefully, from one of our vassals. Must we ask for this loan? Please give us some money, good sir. Okay, there we go. So we now have just cause to invade. They have no allies, but who cares? We're going to claim the Bywater, as it should be part of our realm. Do that, and then we'll call in our friends. You won't come in. You will come in. Very good. And you will come in, but our main ally will not. Now, they ultimately have 3,000 odd men. We don't. So, hopefully, we can uh, get some forces together around here and get his extra couple of thousand. And then from there, we'll be, uh, we'll be alright, I guess. So, we'll make a beeline straight over. Now, he doesn't have more men than us right here, so we should be able to get round. The Bollings are going to come over and join us. What do you mean you unfortunately cannot join? You just said you would join. 
What? The Bollings have joined with their 800 of men. I will have 2,400. He will have 3,800. Ah. Might have a bit of a predicament here. We need some more men. Footmen, preferably. If this is all we can afford, we will take it. Next to 400 there. Now make your way over. We need to escape. They said they would join. I have been ripped off. Even House Bolling, where are their men? You are in this war, Lord Bolling. I do not see you. Why... Are you saying our alliance just died off or something? No, we are allies. Okay. Our betrothal is to a most good. We'll be breaking this betrothal. They have screwed us over. Yes. And Pate, is there any way we can get some men over through you? We are obviously in a predicament right now. So if we can find some people to come over and join us, it will be very, very useful. Somebody of worth around these areas. House Swigert has a match. House Mutant has a match. A few House Goa matches. A Horp. A Slint. Uh, house Horp. How many do you have? 1,000 on. House Swigert, I believe that's you. It is indeed. You have a whole 600 odd men. House Mutant thousand as well. well what if I was to get Richard or Clifton the Hawk's daughter as a betrayal a betrayal to Pete yes see if we can get this through otherwise we'll be in quite a predicament he's got 3,700 men right very good he is accepted can we get an alliance after this no I could perhaps bribe him in, bribe him into it. There we go. We get an alliance out of that. There we go. So we have to save and reload through that. In fact, can I call him in right now? Only he says he would, but we all know the AI are liars. So save him. We reload in. Hopefully, we'll be able to get some uh, extra men together. Without Joffrey screwing us over ultimately yes so my allies said they would join with 2,000 men they then did not join with 2,000 men why is this why have you done this to me AI I still believe in my capabilities but ultimately this is quite a shock to the system now we need to ensure the safety of our house I will be with the army and my heir will send him to be educated somewhere else. Maybe to the Lord here himself. He has a brother, Sir Richard. Yes, we'll send him off to be educated by Sir Richard. My son and heir? No, Sir Richard is not an option. That is a shame. Tarf. We'll send him to Tarf. Maybe there's somebody of worth over in his court. Educate my heir by somebody of worth, please. Alaric Musgood. Yes. And they will accept. Very good. That means we'll get him over to safety. I'm going to continue marching our men over here. You just go to plots. They seek to do stuff. Well. And of course he'll join, yes. When Wharton 20th, 14th we'll, we'll leave. Very good. So we now have the good old uh, guys there coming over. But we need to get further away. So we're going to go over to Tarth here. Yes, yeah, get over to Tarth. That way you'll have the crossing. Now, can we call him in again? We can't call him in again. Why can we not call the man in? He likes the enemies too much. At least we have a thousand two hundred men over there, which is enough to uh, change the balance of war. But we also need more money. We have uh, put ourselves into a lot of debts through this. 
which is rather not good. Now, these men are going to come over to us, I believe. So maybe waiting on the crossing is not the best way. Maybe we should go around and hopefully he won't attack us. I think we'll make our way down here. We'll get some good generals in charge. We have, of course, Mathos here, who is a very good defender. Very good. This man is maybe not the best. We'll see who else we've got. I think he might be the best. So we'll get him, and instead of Clayton, Clayton Suggs, we'll get our own defender. Richard Moringan. So there we go. We'll hopefully get our armies together and then march up and defeat this man. We'll have a look at the terrain as well. Where's he going? Haystack Hall. 21st of May, 18th of May. So we will be out in time. Very good. Also, our flanks are all over the place. Our centre would just get destroyed. But I'm sure we'll hopefully get the other fellows in the centre. So we'll put Mathos over there. Put our own defender here. Very good. Yes, yeah, 21st of May, 18th of May. Please hurry up. Very good. Arrive there on the 30th of May. Hopefully, uh, before he arrives, he won't even arrive. Very good. And it would have been. What's this? Non aggressive pact. Be dissolved. Oh, Head on Stark has died due to poor health, and a useless Rob is now in charge of the North. Yes, by the time we get all the men together, we will have 4,000, which is ultimately good. He's going to the Crow's Nest, and we'll come over to Griffin's Roost, and he'll join us. He'll take the centre flank, which is very good. That's what we want. We need to check the terrain. What are you defensive against? Just the Bywater. So we'll come up from the south, and we'll en engage into it. He's going to Fellwood. Why are you going to Fellwood? Why aren't you coming to us? We need you here. We are the army, not you. We. Now get it together, lad. Get it together. He's got another 200 men come up as well, which is very good. What is he doing? Why are you going to Bronze Gate? This is stupid, my good man. Stupid. And he's going to had low keep. Why? Why is he doing such a thing? He hasn't even got all of his men together. This man is a fool. I owe him nothing. You could say that. We'll lose opinion with us. We are, after all, taking over his uh, brother's land, but we'll keep him happy for now. Make sure he doesn't do any defections or such. I will join these guys over to Bywater, I guess. And then they will leave. What is he doing? Join us, you fool. We need you. That's how war works. You join your army, we go and have a fight. What are you doing? Dude. What are you doing? Why are you going south? Join with us now. There we go. He's now learnt how armies move, and he has taken the centre, I'm sure. With a good two... How many thousand men did he have? Well, you... 1,400 men. Very good, so we'll use our 500, 600, 700, 700 man advantage and engage him straight away. Yes, 4th of November, so we'll, we'll engage. Very good. Very good. 4th of November. Excellent. And we have engaged. Yes, yeah, so ultimately we have better generals. He doesn't even have a general in the centre. We are... We have more men on the right flank. It's basically equal on the left flank, and our centre flank is quite a few men in debt. So hopefully we'll route his right flank with our right flank and then engage his centre. Looks like we're actually routing both of his flanks, and we'll uh, destroy his centre, which is what we really need. Yes, route the centre. Get the horses and chase his men down. We need them gone. Yes. Destroy them, please. Very good. 
Yes, we have lots of horses and we have routed him off. Terrific. He's still got quite a few men, however. And we actually have 100% already. He was captured. Ah, well done, Weeping Town. You captured the man. Well, in that case, we'll enforce our peace. And we'll win the battle. I Meaning we have taken over to Bywater. He has fled his capital over to Longwild Hall, which is very weak. Very good. We'll uh, dismiss all of these men. All of these men and all of these men. But yes, the Bywater is under our control. Now, Shireen Baratheon will obviously be the next step. So send Justin Macy over to uh, have a look at sharp points. But now we have this land. I have instigated a rule that I'll only have land within my own area. And this is not within my own area. So we will land somebody else in the, in this land. Luckily, we have a Lord of House Bywater. Unfortunately, though, there is a chance he might inherit over here. Or at least get a claim to even to just try it. It looks like Gilbert, Bryson, Ariane, Mary, Montford. So no, Montford is quite far behind in the uh, in line here. So we'll go ahead. But no, no, it's also the chance after him his brother does come in line. So no, we will not be able to give it to to Montford here. Unfortunately. So who do we have? Who is a man of worth who can take over this land? The Musgoods already landed. We want to choose them. We of course have a Blackwood, but they already have lands of their own. There is Clayton Suggs. Yes. Clayton Suggs, eh? Can we not edit your little flying pigs? Or we can't. So it's like this is the man we would want in power. Out of everyone we have. We'll, uh... We'll arrange him a marriage to one of our relatives. We have a granddaughter and we have a granddaughter as well. Now, ultimately, uh, these would be the best options. But I kind of want them myself. Um, my sister is very old. We'll give him our sister. Yes. Marry the old woman. There you go, my lady. So, Clayton Suggs, you're now Lord of Bywater. Congratulations. You can have everything underneath. Very good. So he is now our vassal and we are now his heir as well. And we'll continue to be his heir. Which also means we need to uh, get through a new commander, which will obviously be him straight up. So there we go. We have expanded our realm. He now has one not 100 relation with us, because screw us. But ultimately we have expanded. It costs us a lot of gold, but that's what war is. War is spending a lot of gold. The Macy's hook has grown. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.